here. So for this episode, we will be closing out a chapter. All Yours album. The last three songs, All Good, Our Spring, and The Most Awaited, Gemini. Let's go. Mm -hmm. I recognize this song. Did I react to this? Astros, B sides, and match. It could be in one of their reality shows. I don't know, but I feel like I did. But no, I did not. I'm checking the playlist. Alright. I swear I heard this. It's beautiful. Feel it. This is gearing towards um what's the album? Switch up, switch on. I'm hearing Rocky at the back end. He's kind of hiding that he's like singing. <laughs> wow, this could be an easily title track. I wonder why they didn't release this as a title track. It's all good from the title itself. Wow. Okay, let's quick move on to our spring anyway so if you haven't can like and subscribe you're gonna do check live performances special videos of the songs in all yours before we move on to um i think it is mj's album or it was another moonbin sana let's see but yeah just join the team here and we're gonna celebrate MJ's um, enlistment very very soon so kinda sad another bias we'll be going into the military oh this is a different sound Oh, 
속으로 꿈과 함께 태어난 우리의 계절었던 날보다 따스했었지 넌 너무 예쁘게 더 만개한 꽃들처럼 순수하고도 아름다웠었지 사랑이는 너의 미소가 되고 싶어 온내 맘들이 와서 내게 주고파 사뿐하게 내듣는 발걸음마저도 그마저도 내게 사랑스러웠다는 게 괜히 저리 타게 아픈 그 맘이 그러져라 왠지 모르게 우리의 사진 속에는 아직 추억 때까지 다 졌는데 새로운 봄이 떠오더라 우리의 계절이 지나고 속삭이듯이 다시 피어오네요 여전히 우리의 계절은 꽃잎이 마치 눈물 같아 보여 열이게 흩날리는 이 향기 속에 있고만 싶어 숨죽였던 모습 서서히 드러나 세상의 색 달라졌어 아주 조용히 아무도 모르게 사이비 짓고 찾아온 봄의 숨결 우와 사랑이는 너의 미소가 되고 싶어 내게 주고파 사뿐하게 내딛는 발걸음마저도 그마저도 내게 작은 파동이 없는데 넓게 퍼질 대로 퍼진 내 맘은 전혀 사그라들지 않나 온전히 모두 그대로 찬나 딱한 앞에 고 한결같이 온 봄은 너는 새도 오더라 우리의 계절이 지나고 속삭이듯이 다시 피어오네요 계절이 우리의 계절 I don't know. Whenever the bridge comes, I always expect Uno. Ooh. Wow, another easy listening song. Um, well, I had like conversations with Ella. I believe she really said that this album is no skip, and I definitely believe that. This song, before we go to the last Gemini, um, it's been, I think, no waste. This could be the best album of Astro, yet I haven't listened to Switch On, so let's see. But it's true, there's no skip on this album. I pretty much know that I would listen to all of the songs. Um, so far, all good is actually hitting me so hard. So, yeah, this that, that, that would be the best title track, I mean, best track on this album. Um, let's see Gemini. I know Gemini is like most talked about in the recent days because of the announcement of MJ's um, military enlistment. So you, so some of you guys are very very nice to let me know. Uh, gave me links onto the concert. I really wanted to see it, but I had no time to really film <laughs> reaction. So I'll, I'll do just see it by myself and share with you guys my thoughts on twitter if, if if you haven't followed me my socials are in the description and yeah i'm just definitely gonna be missed like his tone gives a lot of extra flavor to 
Astro because MG completes Astro, all of them, you know. Um, but it's interesting to see also what they could do without MJ, you know. MJ's vocals are just so powerful, but I think Moonbin was there all along. So I think Moonbin will definitely shine the next few months or a few comebacks after MJ's enlistment. I think they cover each other really well, so in terms of like them performing as Astro, I don't really see anything bad that would happen without MJ. If anything, that would just show their flexibility and their love for their craft. And there's a lot to say about each of the members. And I truly believe that whoever is gone, definitely people will cover for it. I trust Astro for that. Um, yeah, um, under this video, can we just link videos to me of MJ like fan made videos that I can react to in celebrating his enlistment. I don't want to be sad on it because just to share with you guys two of my biases already just go in the military. I had in song and I had in song of SF, I, SF9 and I had June Ace go in the military already. So he's the third bias. Like it seemed like um, the ones that I'm standing as a bias are the oldest. You know, I feel like, and that's I think a gift and a curse at the same time because I'm still discovering all of them. But with the amount of artistry that they give and they let me feel, that makes me really sad. But I don't want to be sad, you know, MJ don't want that for sure. Let's go Gemini. Oh. Soft, soft. You know, when Uno is really starting a song, that means that song is gonna go deep. You know, that's what I observe with Astro. The, the way that they kind of allotted the lines for themselves, they know how the song will impact people. And I think that's the reason why Arohas are so loved. They are so in love with Astro just because of that aspect. Um, there's no peace place, there's no conversations about line distributions. Oh, 
점점 모든 게 무뎌지게 돼 내가 나를 무너지게 해 별이 돼버린 추억들은 왜 눈물처럼 쏟아지는데 It's a nice ending, Sana. Wow. Gemini should be sung by Arohas to Astro. You know? Um, because we'll be waiting. We will be waiting for all of them. You know, until six of them are complete again. I know it will be a long time, but you know, military service just gonna go by so fast. You know, um, I know it's like easy, easier said than done, but the waiting period is really crazy. Just in time that I'm reviewing this album, MJ announced his enlistment. So how do you feel about that? I feel like. I'm happy to begin with that he's gonna do it and the brighter side is that I know very soon he'll be back you know instead of like prolonging the the enlistment and then wait even more so I think that's the bright side of it and I think he so far has left a very good legacy you know very good image of himself if that I appreciate that even when he's not in the limelight anymore people would still remember him as a beautiful person until he gets back from the military so yeah just like I said um, there will be an episode coming up for MJ um, maybe gearing towards his end this month and just let me know what videos would you like to see of him I can just search one. I could do that, but as a as Aroha, I really wanted to know what you feel about the enlistment, what you feel about the whole group, and they're gonna have a comeback, right? They're gonna have a comeback. I'm really excited, and I know MJ is still part of that comeback, but won't be promoting with them. And yeah, at least we still have one last horror in the meantime before MJ leave. So yeah, if you haven't, can you like and subscribe? See you on the lives. I know.